Hello everyone, in case you haven't noticed, this is Star Wars 2, or Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic 2, the Sith Lords. Um, this is modified, uh, restored modified content mod that I just now realized was out. And apparently, yeah, they imported it, I got it's like July. They just like imported the entire game over to Linux and just like, hey, no fanfare, no news or anything. If I haven't happened to just like, uh, what, just glance at an Ars Technica, uh, little article that was about it and stuff. As much as I like the music, don't like it that loud. That I'm probably gonna get just taken down because of that, but eh, we'll see. If all else fails, I'll just post like five minutes or so or whatever. With character creation and stuff. Anyway, yeah. This just came out. Um, I just happened to notice it come out and stuff, so. Da, 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 da. That's right. Um, it has been a long time since I played this game. Um, I can't remember when the last time I actually played this game. I think it was actually like six or seven years ago I actually put it back in. It might have been five years ago before I put it back in. And I'm trying to remember. Um, force, power, what you could enforce, balanced. Uh, Jedi Guardian was the weapon master they actually have. They actually have prestige classes, if I remember correctly. Wow, it's been a long time. I haven't even thought about this game in a while. Um. I think the last one I played was a Sentinel, I think. I just couldn't wait for Sentinel. So I remember there being a, a bunch of other stuff going along with this. Um, Maybe? Nah. No. Yeah. Maybe? Eh. No. Yeah. Maybe. Okay, um, Sentinel. Okay, get rid of all the negatives. So skills, with some power, willpower, and perception. Constitution is just, just vitality. Oh, yeah, it's also implants, too. I forgot about that. There's implants in, this, in these games. Um, da, 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 da. Um, wow, it's been a while. I really did like this game, too, whenever it first came out. Um, let's talk everyone to death. Skills. Yeah, 
on saying a Sentinel 2. Seems a bit strange. I don't like that actually. better, I think. No, seriously? Oh, no. Skills. I'm sorry. Um... Okay, computer use, I don't know... Securities opening doors, computers, terminals, stealth. Awareness is important. Persuade is important. And treat injury. Yeah. Okay, of course we need fear. Okay, I don't think I need any of these. Yeah, I guess we're plus gonna point about delicious stuff. Um it's not bad. I'm not oh yeah. Empathy, that'd be useful, gearhead. Let's see. I know you actually have to get a lightsaber first. Mm. Um. Close combat training. Um, let's see, I need, they actually updated all the, um, stuff to this, like, so you actually, I don't have a 4K or a 5K monitor, but, you know, whatever. Um, most of these aren't even use, useful to me, it's just current time. I don't remember green armor being that big of a deal. I remember I used to take the disciple, and I usually get and I gave him all armor. He's just, since he was kind of, since he was a counselor, I gave him all this heavy armor training, and then I just went down the line, went all the way straight down. It's just like what points that things that didn't re did if they had a requirement for ar uh, you could, for armor, it's like inhibited by armor. I didn't take it, so he got all the non-armor force powers, and so he's like basically walking a tank. I don't know why I found that. Out. Interesting stuff. I have no idea what some of these even are. Uh, this would be just cool. Um. Oh yeah, cross class skills. I forgot this is also in there. You also write eight algebra for these, so you can actually get other. Skills. Um, let's see. I know repair is pretty. Repair is really useful. Um, this is actually pretty useful too. 
because you can actually walk into things and when you're going to do the mine, then you're going to like disable a mine, you can, you can actually walk into a mine. That's actually pretty useful. Um, and this actually helps you not walk into a mine. Um, in the first game, if you ever actually wanted to watch people play it and stuff, you can actually see people walk. Oh, they go, let's, let's, let's disarm this mine. And you go, and blo it blows up in their faces and stuff. So, let's see. Um, so, I got basic, the basic stuff. Okay, um, this might, this might not seem useful, but it really is. Being able to move is, like, yeah, precise shots, um, tell you what, I have one remaining few time going to take something remotely useful. So remember, I'm going to use, I almost always use two lightsabers, so, or two weapons, but I don't remember what that one is, which is what I'm actually looking for. Oh, here it is, right there, at the fucking top. Anyway. Oh yeah, that's right, they changed it in this one, so it's actually either double-bladed weapon or two weapons. It's even better from there. Uh, Mandarin needs. Jorin Jace. Hmm. I like that one. Time ago in the galaxy far away. A Sith Lords. It is a perilous time for the galaxy. A brutal civil war has all but destroyed the Jedi Order, leaving the alien, alien Republic on the verge of collapse. Amid the turmoil, the evil Sith have spread across the galaxy, hunting down and destroying the remaining Jedi Knights. Narrowly escaping a deadly Sith ambush, the last known Jedi clings to up aboard a battered freighter near the ravaged world of Paragon. Oh, frack, this is Fueling Colony 1. Wow, it's been like a long time since I've like, played this game. I, I'm like remembering stuff now. Hopefully, I won't have a problem with it like being recording or hanging, because people have been saying, oh, it's been hanging at certain spots, or... This is new. And if I'm not mistaken, they also made HD textures also. Hyper Tribe, <laughs> Oh yeah, I forgot about this. Multiple hull breaches. You play as um, Proximity alert. Yeah. The Evan Hawk is adrift in space after a terrible battle. 
Most of its crew are dead or dying. You lie in the medical room in critical condition. You won't survive long without medical attention. The hyperdrive is damaged. Main power must be restored in order to bring the engines online and dock with the nearby Paragus mining station for much needed repairs. Your fate and that of the Ebon Hawk depend upon T3M4, a lone astromech droid. Return to this location at any time to skip the prologue. No, I'm going to do the prologue. Press W A S D to move T three M four and turn. Press caps lock to toggle first person free look. Hold control to look about. So Okay, in order to use this, you need to appear to spike number spikes, you have listening to the bottom of the screen, use one spike, you have selected the Hawks. Hawk appear by asking the console functions. Open the main and container door. This one gives you junk if you fail it. I don't think that was just. I don't know if they actually. I don't know what it Yeah, broken item. Yeah. Sometimes bashing or blowing open a container will break some of the items in the container. But you can use. Um. Cool. Cameras in the garage, engine room, utility lift, access security doors. Security door remote operation offline. Engine room door inoperable and the garage door working. The hardware garage door working. So, get things to the ground out through the garage. Outer hull of the 
of Enhanc, where you will find many parts and mines to use for accessing and repairing the hyperdrive. Use the lift controls to go up. Yeah, we might as well do that now, I guess. You can use this lift. I'm just so glad this game's actually like on Linux and stuff. Demolition skill to either disable or recover these mines. Recovering mines requires a higher demolition skill than disabling them, but you get to keep the mine, which you can then use to set as a trap for enemies or break down into components at a workbench. Got all that? Explosive device in this missile to blow open the engine room door inside the Ebon Hawk. This will give you access to the hyperdrive. After you plant a mine, back away quickly so that you do not take damage. I'm gonna have to get used to controlling this. Starboard side of the Ebon Hawk. I forget. This busted engine port has some needed parts for the Ebon Hawk's hyperdrive. Take the parts here back down below to get main power restored. Yeah. This open hatch has some parts that will be useful for getting main power restored. What else was there? Looks like... No, I don't think it was on this side. I think it was on the other side. Doesn't they get like a little helper too that like, like, dies or something? Exposed wires control the door to the starboard dormitory. The door is currently sealed, but you can override it from here. Success! The door is opened. You can now access the starboard dormitory through the garage. This is the 
to stabilize the condition of the human lying on the bed. The med pack can stabilize your condition. Success! You are stabilized. To recover fully, you will require the medical facilities at the Paragus mining station, but you are not in any danger of dying from your wounds right now. breach in the area beyond this door. Safety protocols prevent you from opening it manually. Try using the security computer in the main hold. something else first, I'm pretty sure. No. 
close the inner one. Open the outer one. in the area beyond this door. Safety protocols prevent you from opening it manually. Try using the security computer in the main hold. I'm pretty sure you actually got a friend. He helped you out with getting the with this puzzle. This is like this is the cargo hold. Huh? Talking to other characters is much like using the computer console in the cockpit. Note that some responses may influence how other characters react to you. Furthermore, certain skills, powers, and attributes may modify which... 3CFD is malfunctioning. If you repair 3CFD... Success! You have fixed 3CFD. Now he will join your party. I need to actually get you repaired. Don't I have like repair kits or something like that? there. Oh, okay, there you are. Um, special weapon, plating. Are you saying no? going on there. And I thought I'd ever do. I don't care. Or press you.
Yes, yes, yes. Hitting the target, I understand. Yes, I know. Stop. Just go. Just do it. This is a workbench. With a workbench, because of the damage to the Ebon Hawk, this workbench has limited functionality. Use the workbench to break down. Okay, I'm going to skip this. Um. Whichever one it is. Yes, I don't really care about you anymore. I'm going to the other top. This is the cockpit. 
You can now plot a course to the Paragus mining station. To dock with Paragus, left. Paragus to. Sensors show the door to the storage compartment is being sliced. There is someone, or something, else alive on the Ebon Hawk. Oh yeah, so you get prestige classes. Put the Sentinel to begin with. What am I going to do for prestige? Um. Hmm. saying that the first thing you have in Hawk, it would, it would, like, crash. But let's find out, shall we? In case, uh, if it doesn't, if I just cut it off here, you, you know what's happening, happened then. It's broken up, I'll just continue it later. But, we'll find out here in a second. Might have. 